Hello, my name is Rob Stern, and I am the editor-in-chief of the new book, Patent Office Litigation, published in November of 2012 by Thomson Reuters West, a book that covers all aspects of the new contested proceedings in the United States patent system. Today, I would like to discuss my first prediction concerning this new world, which I have called the spike. When the new proceedings became effective on September 16th of 2012, the availability of the prior inter-party re-examination process went away. We predicted, as well as other experts, that there would be a substantial number of filings of inter-party re-exams that would occur on or before September 15, 2012. And lo and behold, we were right. There were over 200 filings in the last week before the proceeding no longer became available. Moreover, there is an, an additional spike that was created by filings of the ex-party re-examination process, which exists under the new regime, but with substantially increased filing fees. And there were over 150 of those proceedings filed in the last month before they, uh, the new law came into effect. All of these proceedings are going to be handled by the Central Reexamination Unit at the U.S. Patent Office. And the Central Reexamination Unit is probably going to be overwhelmed by this new increase in work, particularly at the beginning of the process, where they have to make their first initial determination within three to five months of these filings. So I'm predicting now that the Central Reexam Unit, or the CRU as it's become known, is going to have one of the biggest challenges it has ever had since it was founded in 2005. Thank you.